Hello friends, this is Bharat. You all are welcome in this class. In this class, we will see about the system administration in Linux. Here's a list of all the topics that we will cover in this tutorial. What is Linux? Top 5 company that uses Linux in their business environment. What is the Linux system administrator work refers to? Basic tasks of Linux system administrator. What are the skills required a Linux system administrator? And finally, by system administration in Linux only. Now, first of all, what is Linux? Linux is an open source operating system developed by Linux Torvald in 1991. What is the mean by operating system? An operating system an operating system is group of computer program including device drivers, kernel and other softwares and that let people interact with a computer. Example Microsoft Windows is an operating system, Mac OS is an operating system and Linux is also an operating system. Windows and the Mac OS is a closed source operating system when Linux is an open source operating system. It manages computer hardware and software resources. Operating system is an interface between computer hardware and software. Now what is the mean by open source? Open source means anybody can contribute, modify, enhance and distribute the source code of any software. But we are going to talk about the operating system. So uh, operating system that can be contribute, modify, enhance and distribute such operating system is a open source operating system. Now which are the companies uses Linux in their business environment? There are the so many companies exist in this world are using Linux operating system in their business environment. Here is the list of 5 most popular company that uses Linux. The first name in our list is Oracle. Oracle is the biggest and most popular company that offers informative product and services. It uses Linux and also has its own Linux distributions. The second one is a uh, Google. There is no explanation re required for Google because it is the most, com most popular company in this world. It is the part of web and Linux is an operating system that make webs to work. The third name is Amazon. It's again a big company and it requires the system of higher performance and this uh, requirement is fulfilled by the Linux. The fourth name in our list is Facebook. Facebook is a social networking company and the Facebook uh, also use Linux on their servers. The last name is the Samsung. Samsung uh, operating system is Chrome based operating system and the Chrome based operating system is developed in Linux so these are all are the five, five most uh, popular companies that uses Linux in their business environment there are so many other com other company uh, that also uses the Linux but uh, I cannot give you the name of all this company you can search uh, out it on the Google now what is the Linux system administrator word refers to? System administrator is a person who is responsible for installing, configuring and maintaining Linux system, especially in multi-user computers such as a server. The basic tasks of the Linux system administrator. Um, which are the basic tasks of the Linux system administrator? The first task is install and configure Linux system. Second, perform main system maintenance third create system backups for monitor system performance second last provide technical support and guidance and last one maintain system security all these tasks has to perform uh, has been performed by the linux system administrator now what are the skills required for a linux system administrator the first one is a server administration what is the mean by server administration a uh, System administration uh, administrator should have the experience in network environment. 
programming and coding a linux system administrator should know programming and coding the third one is analytical skill is the most important skill because a person a linux system administrator uh, has to analyze the system services and system performance the fourth one is system security system security uh, is the very most important um, for any business and uh, a linux system administrator is responsible for that communication skill communication skill is uh, very most important at any level and uh, for the and linux administrator uh, work on a higher level it's a admin level um, job so communication skills is very most important last one is a problem solving skill problem solving skill uh, means when uh, we configure the system then some problem may raise when we maintaining the services some problem may raise some of the uh, any task when we are performing if there is uh, any problem raise then a linux system administrator should have should have the problem solving skill now why system administration in linux only it's a uh, totally up to you in which operating system you have interest and in which uh, platform you just want to work uh, you choose the open source or uh, open source platform or the closed source uh, platform it's totally up to you but uh, there here is uh, some advantages of the linux that i just want to explain to you uh, so it will give um, a clear idea about it that why you have to do a system uh, you have to do administration in linux only the first one is open source the linux is an open source operating system uh, i already have told you so this is a beneficial thing the second thing is security linux is most secure operating system in this world compared to other operating systems like windows why it's a secure uh, because of uh, sc linux concept uh, that we will see and uh, uh, linux is a secure because uh, to access a single file in a linux is uh, not possible without any privileges without the privileges you cannot uh access a single file even so it's a most secure operating system the third one is free to use not all the uh operating system that uh, develop uh, based on the linux are free but some of the operating systems that based on the linux are uh, free some of the operating systems are uh, required uh, subscription uh, to their vendor but it's a uh, really cheaper uh, than uh, it's a really cheaper comparison to the windows now multitasking what is the mean by multitasking multitasking in the sense the two tasks or two or more than two tasks at the same time and the linux is has ability to perform two or more than two tasks at the same time now second last multi user it's a multi user operating system means two or more than two user can log in at the same time and last one is multi desktop environment uh, linux is a uh, multi desktop environment means it provide you multiple desktop like graphical desktop multi user desktop and so on so friends uh, that's all for today's class it's a time to take leave thank you